Apparently, it's been running a lot. Mom, I, I had a contract. I got paid for it. I just didn't get paid that much. Can I still borrow 500 bucks, please? A new audition in Santa Monica? Oh, well, that's gonna be a tight squeeze. Yeah, I'll, I'll make it work. I, I will, I'll get a bikini and I'll go. It'll be, it'll be fine. Text Brad Bumble. Yes, I can meet you at Sassafras. Looking forward to it. Smiley face. So are we still having improv practice at Jason's house? Because his house is, oh, right? Shit, I'm out of gas. Nikki, hey, I'm going to that, for that meeting with the director that I was telling you about, that side film. Uh, no, technically, I don't have the role yet, but I have been meeting with the director a bunch to discuss it and and Nikki, I gotta call you back, okay? I can't look for parking and talk at the same time. It's just, I can't. I'll call you later, okay? Yeah, 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 love you, bye! Yes, I saw the transfer, thank you so much. Uh, I got that meeting right now, okay? So I gotta go, I gotta call you back. No, I'm not gonna give you his number, okay? He directed an episode of Orange is the New Black, okay? I highly doubt he wants to kidnap me, okay? I love you, and I gotta go, okay? What? I hope so too, Mom. Okay. Bye. Okay. <laughs> okay. So, uh, how's pre-production going? Oh, so good. I finally got casting locked down, which you know is a huge weight off my mind. Mm -hmm. We got the DP from Stranger Things, and I got a producer from The Good Place, so... <sighs> Dream Team. <laughs> hey, but before we talk about anything else, I just wanted to say thank you so much for considering me for this. Like, a SAG feature is huge for me, and I'm just, I'm really excited to put the work in, honestly. About that. I'm a very personal director. And, um, well, you know this industry is so cold and so unforgiving. That's why I wanted to make sure that I had you here in person to tell you that we went with someone else for the role of Jacqueline. Oh. Now, I know a lot of directors, producers, they would have just emailed you that. But to me, that's a bullshit move. You're not some newsletter that I'm unsubscribing to, right? You're a human being. Yeah. What, like, I'm perfectly fine with you when I think you're gonna be a star of my movie, but once I don't put you in the movie, I don't have the time. No, 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 I get it. Yeah. Thank you. Seriously, I love the comedy. The YouTube videos, <laughs> hilarious. And there's gonna be work for you in a future project. But for this role, it just all seemed a little big. I needed something more grounded. Yeah, gotcha. Um, well, thank you for letting me know. Uh, I should really shit out of here. Hang on, where are you going? Look, I didn't call you over here just to ruin your day. I wanna talk about this. Tell me what you're thinking. About what? I don't know, how you're feeling. I'm sorry, but I don't think you really wanna hear my feelings right now, so I should really just- No, I do, okay? I know that my decisions, they affect actors' careers. And that means something, and I need to own that. Come on. Please. Okay. Here's what I'm thinking. You said you wanted to hear my feelings? Yeah. Well, here I fucking go. They said, make your own opportunities. I build up a fan base. And so I did. 
I make hundreds of videos. I have 20,000 followers, and guess what? It was all the wrong content. It's all useless. Why? Because I chose a career that's made up of entirely all rejection. It's not working. I've been at this for 13 years. I'm 30 years old and I'm not even on the D list. And that fucking hurts. You know what? You should use that pain. Fuck you. Use the pain? Where? On what? Pain isn't useful to an actor unless they have a place to use it. Like a role in a goddamn movie, for example. I don't need pain, Mitchell. I need a job. So what more do I have to do for you that I haven't done already? Huh? What do people want? Do I need to be sexier? Show more skin? Huh, like this, is this good? Like a skin sex model? Huh? Ooh. Huh? Maybe, maybe more wholesome. Like a sitcom multicam mom, like What's Her Nuts from King and Queens or Everybody Loves Raymond? <laughs> oh, Barbara. Mm, I don't care if I sleep like a baby. I want to sleep like my husband. <laughs> uh, boom, laugh track. What else do you want? You, you want me to sing? Huh? Sure, sure, I can do that. You're as smooth as Tennessee whiskey. You want me to dance, huh? Sing and dance? Well, I'm hot blooded, chicken and see. Got a fever of 103. So come on, baby, do, do, do more than dance. Well, I'm, I'm hot blooded, I'm hot blooded. Or maybe just with my face. Face dancing. Thanks. Ah! Oh, no, no, no. That's right. I forgot. You said you wanted grounded. I just wish that one time when it really mattered that I was good enough. Because I don't have a backup plan, Mitchell. This is the only thing I know how to do. I think you deserve some honesty, too. Do you remember the night we went out for drinks after the read-through? Well, I kind of felt like you were leading me on. And then when nothing happened, I guess I, I got kind of turned off. I don't want to do a 21-day shoot with that between us. Anyway, food for thought, huh? <laughs>